Yeah, good. I have to visit the house I've done before. Yeah, good. Maybe that's why they moved out. Yeah, that's why they moved out. Last I've seen it. Is that it? There it is. It's behind, it. it's behind me. It's behind that? Yeah, I just saw the head. Okay. Did it look like a big one? Just the head. It was like halfway up the, the shelf. Probably there's one in the house, roughly. Um, is that big? Yeah, it's here up. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Oh, wow. Trying to climb. They generally don't climb, red bellies, but obviously when they feel like they're in a precarious predicament. Okay. Red belly black snake. Yeah, probably a lot down from the oil. Yeah. It's only a baby, really. Actually, it's a few years old. Oh, really? A baby's about this big, yeah. It's a few years old. They're completely independent, sexually mature. Um, Male or female? It's very hard to tell, okay. especially at this age. When they do get a bit older, you can generally tell the boys because they biff on for mating rights and things. Yep. So the boys are generally covered in scars, but at this age, it's a very beautiful looking specimen. Our red bellies around here are pretty nice looking because they don't get as many frogs. A lot of, they prefer to feed on frogs and the frogs have a worm larvae that it leaves in the snake, oh, okay. which gives them all lumps and things. But because most of our red bellies out here feed on Reptile, ah, uh, yeah, lizards mainly and other snakes. Then, um, they're just a really, really beautiful black with red. So, yeah. It's pretty calm, right? Oh, it's very calm. He might have a nip. There he goes. Oh, he's okay. had a little nip at the shoe. <laughs> but that, that's not because he's an aggressive animal or anything. It's just been apprehended by what he thinks is someone that's going to eat him. Yep. And he's just terrified for its life, really. He doesn't know what's going on. and. It's associating me as the antagonist in this ordeal and it's just trying to defend itself. So, but it's not going ballistic or anything, it's just more curious at this point as to what's going on. Obviously if I let it get to my hand it might yeah, give it a bit of a kiss like it did my shoe. So you've got to be safe with Fred Billies, but they're by no means a, an aggressive snake or... Um, yeah, well, I was very surprised that it hasn't actually... Teaching the wifey the tricks of the trade. Yeah. That's not what snakes do over there. Okay. Even with me following after it, it's not trying to attack me or hurt me, it just wants to go away.